If you go from first dimension and you are willing to go deeper, if you are willing to go out of this first dimension mentality, you, you're looking at becoming a relational type of coach. Where a partnership agreement between you and the players is now becoming a reality or becoming part of your coaching methodology. And one of our drills we call the spotlight drill. So at the end of our session, we will get the group together and we'll single out one guy. Put him in the middle, he's in the spotlight. And we've got 45 seconds to say things about him, not rugby related. You can't say he's a great kick off the ball. It's got to be non rugby related. So 45 seconds, we're going to say to this guy, what does he bring to the team? Simple little things like that when you deliberately coach in the second I mentioned, to start giving confidence, to start motivating, but it's, it's a deliberate action for coaches. For you guys probably more natural, but for a coach that is measured on winning. And you've got to win Saturday. It's not, hey, take your time. <laughs> take your time with this winning. <laughs> we get measured every Saturday. And every Saturday, the pressure is on but you've got to deliberately action your second dimension coach. And then your third dimension, you go from relational to transformation. And that's where I love the saying where it says players don't care how much you know until they know that you care. So you can have your PhDs and your master's degrees. They only start reacting when they know you care about them. Deeper than just winning rugby matches. And you have to deliberately coach in that third dimension. And uh, just a simple drill that we do <laughs> drill again. Um, in our group, we, we are four coaches and we've got a group of 45 players. So we will, each of us get 10 players and we, we got to home visit your kid for 15 minutes. As coach, as you walk into that room or into that house, you see that boy blossom. He, he, he can't believe that his rugby coach is visiting him at his home. He, he, they are just astonished. And it's a simple thing, but now you start moving into the third dimension, into the soul and into the heart area. Because tomorrow, when that boy walks into the school or into your environment, it's high five. Oof. His coach was at my home. When, not if, when we win this World Cup, and the next one, and the next one. <laughs> you will know that the health organization was the main reason why the Spreebox are dominating more than that. <laughs>